He's become the most recognizable civil rights attorney in America, and now a South Florida law school will bear the name of Benjamin Crump. And there to witness this special honor were some of his, the families he's fought for, including Tyree Nichols. Local 10's Larry Livingston spoke exclusively with them. He's live in Miami Gardens with why this means so much to so many. Larry. Point of note, as I understand it, the only other law school in this country named for a black man is actually in my home state of Texas at Texas Southern University, the third good Marshall School of Law sits. That's an HBCU. That was until today. Three, two, one. Did it happen? <laughs> Congratulations. An historic unveiling. The St. Thomas University College of Law is now the Benjamin L. Crump College of Law. And whereas renowned civil rights and personal injury attorney Benjamin L. Crump has been referred to as Black America's Attorney General. The occasion marked by official proclamations and celebrity congratulations. Ben has uh, been an absolutely uh, spectacular uh, friend and guide and that's why it was important for me to be here. So I am the most blessed man in the face of the earth today. Crump was surrounded by his family, partners and friends, but perhaps the most high profile attendees at today's unveiling, his clients. The deaths of their loved ones have sparked protests, movements and calls for social justice and reform. Salute him and let him know that I'm proud of him for the work that he not only did for the Trayvon Martin Foundation, but that he did for so many other families. You have to come and support good people because we're strong, we're in numbers, so we all stick together. And I'm thankful that he's helped our family and that he's continuing to help other families. Including Tyree Nichols' parents. Last night, they attended the president's State of the Union address Today, they told me they would not have passed up on this invitation either. The value that is taught here will extend out into the public with these new lawyers that's coming. So I'm thinking they will make a change. It's a blessing to know Mr. Crump. It's a blessing for him to be our lawyer. And it's a blessing to be here for this historic event. If the law doesn't protect the least of us, then it doesn't protect any of us. Pretty powerful celebration today, and we also can tell you that the unveiling came with three and a half million dollars in donations to the law school here, including one from Crump and his firm himself. And school officials say they're already planning a new facility for the law school here to accompany the Crump Center for Social Justice, which was already established here previous to the new naming. We're in Miami Gardens at St. Thomas University. Laren Livingston, Local 10 News.